welcome to my channel inspired birdie for a dollar tree haul so i have a few items that i'm going to share with you that i got for christmas uh, but also items that are just very generic so i'm going to start with the generic stuff first which is all of these items here but the reason that i picked these up is every year at the holiday season I'm sure you guys also in your areas there's many different donations that are going on for you know families in need that kind of stuff where they require things like toothbrushes and toothpaste and uh, clothing socks those are the pretty much the things that are asked for for a lot of these different kind of uh, donations and goodwill uh, charities that are going on so we have one here where it's kids that are in need that have been rehomed uh, and have absolutely nothing so some of the things that were asked were for things like toothbrushes toothpaste uh, washing stuff, uh, socks, clothing, that kind of stuff. So I'll show you what I got from the Dollar Tree. A lot of really great items that you can purchase if you're looking to do something like this or even as a gift. So some deodorant, some great uh, name brand toothpaste. So that's, oops, that's great. Colgate for a dollar. Normally you'd pay about three bucks for that. Some uh, shave gel. Some toothbrushes and if you want to look for a little kid too they've got lots of great things for little kids uh, some socks I thought these would be really great for like thicker socks so these are crew socks and then some girls like tennis shoe type socks and then I thought this was really fantastic that Dollar Tree had clothing items and I picked up these two shirts to also add in so these are golf shirts and they are uh, long sleeve so I'll just open it up to show you okay so here it is opened up so this is a large and as you can see it is long sleeve and I'm not sure about the brand I'm assuming it's a Dollar Tree type brand and then I got this one as well. And this one is also a large, different brand though, Valento. So if this is something that you're interested in, they had a lot of other shirts as well. And they are 100% uh, cotton, as you can see there. All right, guys, so some other complete random items. Uh, first off, chocolate of the week are Glossette Peanuts. I always talk about their uh, like large size treats like this because these are a great buy. Okay, I've also hauled this before. So these are little dough sets. It's kind of like a play on Play-Doh, but I didn't get it for the actual dough. I get it for the shapes inside, and I didn't have this one, so I grabbed this one. But yeah, so it's for the shapes that are inside because those can be quite expensive. Just to buy like a container of Play-Doh shapes can be anywhere between like $15 and $20. So I've spent about $5 on five different ones and have tons of different shapes. Also picked up some construction paper for a Christmas DIY. I was there about a week ago and I did not see construction paper at all. So really glad that they got that in. So it's just standard construction paper and then I saw this glow wand I thought this would be a lot of fun for my daughter so it's a unicorn glow wand this uh, this is definitely new at my Dollar Tree this Lion King coloring book they did recently start featuring the Lion King stickers but it was really cool to see that they now have the coloring book and this is a giant coloring book and yeah, this is from the most recent uh, Lion King movie, so it is recent. So if you have any kids that enjoy coloring, check out your Dollar Tree. I do love too that they have these fun little activities as well, so it's not just coloring. So that's the first item. Second item is are these Jot watercolors. I use these quite frequently. I think that they... I, Personally, I think that they work really well uh, if you're going to be doing some painting activities with some kids. So it just looks like that. You get eight colors and you do get a brush included. Uh, I was super excited to find these Play-Doh kits. So I actually went there specifically looking to see if they had any Play-Doh kits because my kid is currently really into Play-Doh and it wasn't actually the Play-Doh that I was interested in. Play-Doh 
is quite cheap, like the actual name brand Play-Doh. This stuff is actually quite cheap on its own. It was more the tools that you use to play with your Play-Doh. Those can end up being really expensive, especially just to get little shape cutters like those. So they have a bunch at Dollar Tree. I picked up three different uh, kits. So here it has a bunch of different shapes. And then it has this little tool that you can use to like press the uh, Play-Doh through. And I think you use this little guy here. This one I was really excited about. So you put the Play-Doh in the tube and then you can push through and make different designs. And it comes with a bunch of different uh, pieces to make designs. And then this one is just a bunch of shapes as well. And then a little roller. Sorry for the glare, guys. But yeah, I specifically went just to see if they happened to have anything for Play-Doh and they did and that was really exciting and that was my big find this time around. So you never know, always check out your Dollar Tree if you're looking for something in particular. Uh, now this is a repurchase. I do have the dog and cat one already, but these are just really fun if you wanna do some arts and crafts with your kids. Either arts and crafts like sticking things on them to make you know, different items or just a color or paint we really like to paint these so this one here is unicorns and you get six or sorry not six you get eight pieces this one you get eight pieces as well but this is a duo so you have the dog on one side and you have the cat on the other side all right moving along so picked up some batteries now that's not a new thing I always pick up batteries I think it's in like every haul that I ever do and I was really excited for these artificial enchanted nails. Now, if you're new to my channel uh, and you're into nails, check out my Dollar Tree nail review video. I do have a video on my channel. I wear these all of the time. I love the Dollar Tree nails. First off, they're so super cheap and you can get a lot of really fun designs. So I thought this design would be a lot of fun for Halloween. Sorry for the glare of my light. There we go. Look at how fun that is, guys. Now, I don't know how well these ones work because I've never used this brand before, but I've used all of the other brands that the Dollar Tree has, and they've all worked perfectly fine. So, super excited for that. For Halloween, I picked up this one last item. These are just stickers. Sorry, guys, I have a bit of a cold, so mind my voice. But yeah, these are stickers. So, obviously, it says there they're window clings. I'm getting them for a different reason. I'm gonna do one final DIY before Halloween is over. And I just loved this uh, picture. All right guys, so let's get into Christmas because I'm super excited. It's my absolute favorite holiday. And I certainly didn't expect to pick up any Christmas stuff during this Dollar Tree uh, visit, but I could not help myself. So first off, these are not Christmas, uh, but I'm gonna be using them for a Christmas DIY. I just absolutely fell in love with this design. I've never seen them at the Dollar Tree before. They only had three, uh, probably because other people purchased them. So I grabbed all three because like, they're just so beautiful. I'm gonna use some of them just for photos and then I think I'm gonna use maybe one for a DIY. So yeah, that's the first item. I grabbed all three of those. And then they're, Oh, these things are just getting so much more beautiful. Their art, like look at this. So this is like a wall decor you can hang, but look at how gorgeous this is. And this is a pretty hefty size. I don't remember seeing this last year. And seriously, at Winners or Home Sense or something like that, you'd pay like 10 bucks. So fell in love with it, had to have this. Um, I also picked up this elf. This is for a DIY, but again, this is a pretty like hefty size. It's pretty big. They're coming out with so many great things that you almost just don't even have to DIY anymore. It's unbelievable. And then I fell in love with this sign as well. Look at the glitter. I'm not sure if the camera picks up the glitter. So all of the snow glitters. The only glitter in the photo is the, the snow, anything that's white. Absolutely love it. So gorgeous. All right, aside from that, picked up these two little containers for a DIY. I can't get them apart, but they're both the exact same. So I thought these would be a lot of fun to work with. I also picked up some Christmas trees because these things go super fast. 
They also have them in white now. I thought that was a lot of fun. And then I picked up uh, some garland. This stuff goes really fast as well. So it's 15 feet for a dollar. Pretty good, but I got this for a DIY as well. And that is pretty much it, guys. So doesn't really seem like a lot, but this cost me almost 40 bucks. So I know there's a lot here. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed my really quick haul. Uh, stay tuned. I will definitely be doing more, especially for Christmas. Thank you so much for watching. All right, guys, love and peace to you all. Bye.